And welcome everyone here in Twitch chat and everybody on YouTube for the return of Burn Aggro. New version though, brand new Burn Aggro deck uh, that I put together today. We played Burn Aggro a couple of days ago that I wasn't super satisfied with because it was like the goal of the deck was to go wide and, you know, use like Brothers Bond and Arena Battlecaster and stuff like that and try, try to go wide and get the damage in like that. And it just wasn't successful. Everybody is like uh, ready for... Uh, the go wide strategies right now there's lots of you know static shock and withering whale and all sorts of just removal everywhere um and then there's just a bunch of like spiders in the metagame that block your stuff it just wasn't really what what we want to be doing I, I don't think um hey what's up blade um so instead what i want to be doing is like we couldn't like finish out games and i felt like the deck needed a lot more burn and so we're going hyper burn with this burn aggro and we're going uh, damage to the Nexus is really what we're focusing on, you know, so we're not letting our opponent stabilize. So look at all these cards that do damage to the, the Nexus. We have Blade's Edge, um, Legion Saboteur, Teemo gives them Puff Caps, you know, draw those Puff Caps, a uh, Boom Crew Rookie, uh, Legion Grenadier when it dies, Mystic Shot, Get Excited, uh, the Salesman gives them those Caustic Casks, uh, Chump Wump, Again, you get Mystic Clouds or Mushroom Clouds, give them some more Mushroom Clouds, get, get them some more Puff Caps, and Decimate. So all sorts of ways just to do direct damage where you don't have to be attacking. And I kind of feel like that's where we want to be. So I'm excited about this deck. I think this that this could be in a good spot. I think this is a good response to all these like Ezreal removal decks that all they're trying to do is kill all your stuff and stay alive and then uh, have Ezreal kill you. Well, if you don't, you know, if you can just do enough damage to them, and then, uh, you know, have all, all this direct damage, you know, they can't stop that. So that's my plan. So let's give this, let's, uh, give this a try. Um, I don't think Blade's Edge is necessarily a three of must. No, I, I don't think so. Um, no, I, I, yeah, I'm, I'm happy just playing two. There's a lot of times, like, where, like, for an entire car, Blade's Edge isn't doing enough, but, um, when you're more like it's better when you're more defensive you it has better uses the more defensive your deck is and we're not a very defensive deck so it's not it's not as good in our deck compared to others um decimate is good at finishing the game off but i think we mulligan that i'm going to keep the salesman uh, we want something a little earlier salesman is such a great blocker this really helps you win combat races like against other decks that are trying to attack you and you know looking at lucian's an aggressive champion so they're probably going to be attacking nice got all the cards of the cat attack deck yeah can try a new version of Katarina, focusing on the attack trigger. Um, yeah. That's just so good. I'm just gonna go straight to combat. We have double decimate. Good luck. I'll do better this time. Well, our deck looked great there because my opponent didn't really play any cards. They didn't actually do anything. Their deck was probably supposed to do something. It's the problem with playing cards that they can't block. Yeah, you know, we still have, you know, like our 9-1 drops, and, you know, with all the Teemos also trying to get as much damage in early like that as possible. Okay. We're going to... I think we get rid of Mystic Shot, honestly. Mm. 
and didn't really improve. Ooh. Get him, Teemo. It's my favorite one. That was a good card to have. <clears throat> Alright, so we'll take four. I could see discarding this house spider. This means they get to uh, Vile Feast my Draven now. But that does take Elise and Vile Feast. They get a spider. It's not quite a two for one. No Vile Feast. So Withering Whale. Yeah, probably Withering Whale. One toughness. Reporting in. Hmm. Never mind, not withering well. I got punished for not going straight to attacks. Hey, WQ, going good. Going real good. They still have four cards. Um, we still got 14 damage to do. There you go, that's a good one. There's nothing to fear. I'm not sure if I need the salesman right now. I'll still play it. Puff Cavs. Love it, WQ. Yep, we gave him five. It's our best emote. We must all make There's the Vile Feast. Hit 
course they don't. Yeah, they're not acting like they have removal at all. Which I hope they don't. Okay, good. Because of course I'm. I know we got rid of. We did get rid of a get excited, but I want to refill the hands. See the Devastian order from here. I'm on the verge of something. Immerse Puff caps. Ooh. We can give him some more puff caps. I'll flip Teemo. And it's just good to do that. You know, give him those puff caps as early as possible because just the more, you know, the more cards they draw afterwards, the better chance they draw some puff caps. Take one. All we gotta do is seven more damage. What's up, Zufar? I'm doing good. Yeah, doing real good. Yeah, we're getting so close to that 12-hour stream. We're we're gonna have it. We're gonna have it real soon. Any puff caps? No puff caps. Take two here. Take two here. Take two here. Looks like we're going to be 2-0. Oh. We'll see if they got life gain. That's still them dead. Get him, Teemo. Yeah, Teemo. Got the win. More mushroom. I think this deck's good. Like, I think it is. Yeah, absolutely. You can copy the Brom deck. Absolutely. Um, the list. Hey! Santa Pine Piece. Gift and out of sub. Thank you so much. Daphneer. Welcome to the channel. Draven Teemo Mirror. Or like, a, you know, like, so they're a Draven Teemo deck. Actually, maybe these house spiders are good in the mirror to get a lot of blockers. Or like, because I'm, I'm expecting them to be more of a, um, more of a creature heavy deck than we are. I have my orders. But I could be wrong. Maybe somebody's just playing the same deck, you know? Nope, not the same deck. In position. Behind you. All right, so the, uh, yeah, there you go. We're, that link that Zufar put out has all the decks on it. Like that's where all the decks are. Um, you have to kind of scroll down for the Braum mid-range because we, we played it 13 days ago and I just and uh, actually just played the exact same list. So there we go. There is the list for for you, Joseph. That has the Braum mid-range. I'll do better this time. Yep, so there. I was thinking that they're going to be like the creature creature version, which is why I want these house spiders. First big mission. Won't find better this side of the sun. No one's the wiser. It's a good card. Just gonna put this here. You break it, you buy. I guess the yeah the damage goes to them too. I mean that's good for us. And down to 14. I do need to update the sub goal count. Good call. 
Their first of the day. I mean, there's something else. Right. It's possible they just don't attack. Yuck. Well, that's even worse than the don't attack. I was going to say that would be kind of bad where I wouldn't be able to fit in Boom Crew Rookie. Blade. Because, yeah, we are one sub goal away from a 12 hour stream, so we only need four subs. And so, if you're in chat and if you want a sub, just let, let Blade know. Right, so, Demacia. Demacia Zed. We'll get rid of the chump lump, but I'm not even sure if that's really what I should be doing. The chump lump's not bad. Salesman's not bad either. Explosives bright. So I'll play the saboteur. So if they, because if they have a one drop. There you go. And if our one drops are going to tr trade, I want to trade and do a damage instead of trade and not do a damage. Hang on, Buzzball. Hey. So we got Elusive Splashing Demacia. Cocorito. There we go, Gville. Getting this up. Thank you, Blade. Reporting in. That's sub number two. My shield is. Uh. And Zach Tactics. Thank you, Blade. So is this attack worth it? So we take we we deal. They like you know block here, here, and here. So they take. Three, six. They take six damage, go down to 13. Three of my creatures die, two of their creatures die. So I'm trading in a three for two, and we get six damage in. I think that sounds good. Looking for this? This one's trouble. Okay, so we get five damage in. They they let me keep Legion Saboteur. Just trying to help. So we're down one card now. They're up they have one more card. Basically playing the salesman because it uses my mana better. You cannot escape. Where are you going? Well, get rid of some of their elusives. 
maybe. Obviously, they can have barriers or twin disciplines, things like that. Is this worth it? Basically, do I go like Decimate and then Experimenter next turn? I feel like I need to play Experimenter next turn. Yeah, Decimate likely does more damage. This likely trades with something and does two, but this does four. So it's like, do we want to trade and do two or do four? Yeah, see, this would have traded with that 3-2. That's what I'm not... I'm not sure if I should have just played that. Because of where we are. Fast as wind, light as air. Mm. So we don't have very much life. Dang. Should have played Grenadier. See, like, my plan, of course, was to just get excited upstairs and discard my 6-drop. I just wasn't going to be playing the 6-drop. And then I needed... I basically had... If they didn't have that, I had two draws to find something that dealt two damage. Which, you know, that's a lot of cards in our deck to have two cards that, that dealt two damage. So I still liked our chances. Oh yeah, we're playing swim. Explosives pride. I would not like to take any damage. No, thank you. Puff cap number one. Already in there. Reporting in. House Spider is kind of a perfect blocker for these two. Alright, so we'll have deal two, deal one. Play Draven first. Pre combat. Probably, right? It's Draven time. I think it's Draven time. I think it's Draven time. Won't find better this side That's a great this card. It's a great card. Um Alright, so I attack out, how do they block? Like the So Rookie blocks the 3-1. And then they probably just throw both of these in front of these. And so they take one. And then I Blades Edge the you rookie. Die of boredom? Okay, ready. You break it, you okay, so they're trading.
They can see me? Not trading. I didn't think there'd be a trade. Used cast salesman is awesome. It's Draven time. Well, hey there, good looking. Brewing up some. All right, so. Sure about that? So Teemo's Mushroom Cloud will flip my Teemo. It's definitely going to be a close game. That you know, Swim's got a lot more cards over there. I, I don't. I'm relying on what we got right now. Augmented Experimenter is my best draw. So leveling up Draven, discarding a transfusion. Some puff caps. One. Armed and ready. All right, Timo is armed and ready. This is gonna hurt for you. Got an axe with your name on it. Well, we're gonna do the obvious play. Spinning axe. This. I kind of expect another whirling death. Since they're willing to block with Draven. Oh, transfusion. Okay, that also makes sense. Well, this is gonna be this is gonna be rough. Puff caps. No, puff caps. What are you doing? Let's do this. So right now this is um Death doesn't scare me. Six damage. Put me down to three. And that's two damage in hand. I don't think it could Yeah, so basically we're likely dead. I don't think it gets better for me blocking with Teemo. And blocking over here doesn't matter. The, uh, Draven now has Overwhelm when Draven levels up. So I think this, you know, like that Whirling Death level up and then the Transfusion save Draven. I think that's going Time to be game. The money makers. Yep. The end. Transfusions. Very good. The caustic, uh, or like the cask, used cask salesman. That's the name of that card. That's such a clutch card in the Noxus aggro mirror. You know, got got a couple of great blocks in with those caustic casks. That's such a clutch card. Um, but there we go. So we we only so you know we only went three and two here with the burn aggro. 
um, didn't face any Ezreal. You know, that's that's kind of like what you know. That's our our main uh, our main deck that we're fighting right now. Um, just in Legends of Runeterra in general, but um, you know, unfortunately, with those five matches, we didn't see any Ezreal. Um, the Braum deck we faced three Ezreals, <laughs> so I, w I wish we could flip those. <laughs> Because the Braum deck doesn't really have like the removal and stuff for the Ezreal. So I wish we could have flipped those two, but. Um... But yeah, I like I like this deck quite a bit. I think this this deck is is really good. And uh you know, just kinda like how the like the those mirror matches, like that's it's just really close. You know, you know, pretty coin flippy. 50-50 there. Swim got me uh that game. And, uh, yeah, there we go. All right, Burn Aggro. Um, I, th I would, yeah, I think this is a really good level up deck. You know, like if you're looking for a deck that's fast um, to level up with, I, I really like this deck. I think this is a good version. Um, also, like with the extra burn spells and everything here. Um, yeah, yeah, we were just playing against Swim there. Okay. Blade, getting us that that last sub. Thank you so much, Blade. Santa Blade, gifting out some subs. GLX, welcome to the stream. Now you got all those, so our new subs. Remember, you got your emotes. Every time you get a sub, we get to, you know, throw out those hype boats. Show some support for our new subs. All right, and that sub goal means we're going to be doing a 12-hour stream here soon. In the next few days, we'll all, uh, you know, schedule that. Um, all right, but that's, that's burn aggro. Um, again, those of y'all watch on YouTube, hit that like button over there, leave the comments. Let me know what you think of this deck. Give it a try yourself. Um, if you want something fast, like this is not, not too difficult of a deck to play either. Uh, you know, it's go upstairs. So, you know, like if you're in, you know, silver, gold, like that kind of stuff, and you, you want a, a deck to help you level up where the games are pretty quick, give this deck a try and, and let me know. I think this is, a good deck versus the all the Ezreal decks that are running around um, right now. Um, but uh, yeah, that's Burn Aggro. Uh, that's all I got. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you for the next video.